Hello, I'm Tanya, and today I'm going to be taking this SLK for a spin. But first, let's get the roof down. Now, as you can see, it's got a fully automated roof and only takes just 25 seconds to complete the whole process. Now, the boot is a really good size, and obviously, when this roof is then in the boot, it does compromise your boot space, but there's still plenty of boot space left to take this away for a weekend on Little Trim. Now, I'm here in sunny Sussex. Why don't we give this SLK a little spin. So this SLK is the 230 and it's actually ULES compliant which is super useful now in the living in the world that we do. Now this is a 2001 model which is the facelift model and it's got some real good attention to detail areas that I really like such as the beautiful white dials which match perfectly with the bird's eye maple wood and you may not know this but it's one of the rarest woods on the planet. This example has been specced up with the amber red metallic and teamed up with the black anthracite leather seats. So you may be wondering what SLK stands for, sport, light and compact and she definitely is. Now this SLK handles really well. It's so much fun to drive, especially in this beautiful sunshine down here in Sussex. For the price point of these cars, it really is a no-brainer for a great summer bargain and so much fun to drive. Let's try the Benz. The handling is really, really positive. And I tell you what, it feels really lovely to feel this lovely maple wood on the steering wheel. This branded wind diffuser means you can drive with the top down without having to worry about getting the hair in your eyes. So you can really take these bends at speed. It's got some great storage compartments too in the doors and a little one here behind the seat so you can really keep all those little essentials in the car with you. This version is mated to the five-speed Tiptronic gearbox and it really is super smooth. Unlike most convertibles, which have a soft top, this has a folding metal roof, so you can use it all year round. When this car came out, it had strong competition from BMW and Porsche, but this was the only one that had the metal roof and not just a soft top. So it really made it go that a little bit above and beyond for the quality you can get from Mercedes. To summarise, if you want to get yourself out in the sunshine and get the wind in your hair, then I really recommend this SLK. It's super fun, super nippy, great handling. It has some great attention to detail too. So why don't you get yourself out there and enjoy an SLK 230.